So these new Hoka Super Shoes come in two different colorways. You have the option of the Evening Sky Lettuce or the Cerise Solar Flare. I've got to be honest, I do prefer the blue ones as these are a bit bright. The Cielo X1s are Hoka's latest and most advanced Super Shoe. They have a state-of-the-art carbon fibre plate running through them, Piba foam and an aggressive rocker. After taking them out for a run with a few strides, I think they feel similar to the Alpha Flies from Nike. The upper is knitted and feels quite nice on foot. They are very breathable and feel like a sock when you pull them on. Hoka are calling it an asymmetrical gusseted tongue, which sounds a bit weird, but it does feel very comfortable. The traditional lacing pulls up the sides and feels really snug. The outsole on Hoka's, I feel, are always very good, and nothing's changed with these shoes. They provide a lot of grip, and they have rubber in the certain areas that you need it. This racing shoe feels very breathable, aggressive and cushioned. What do you think of them? Look. <laughs> Daddy's new shoes. A little bit big for you. <laughs> wow. Do you like them, Maya? They're a nice colour. It comes in at quite a weighty 264 grams, which is slightly heavier than most of its rivals, but it definitely makes up for it in its pop and comfort. The stack height is 39mm by 32mm, so they drop 7mm. They don't feel as aggressive as a Vaporfly 1 or 2, maybe about the same as a Vaporfly 3. But yeah, I can't wait to try these even more and maybe racing them in a few weeks' time. I had the Hoka Carbon X2s before these and I feel like these are slightly better, to be honest. They just provide a bit more cushioning and feel more like an Alpha Fly. I'm not saying anything was wrong with the Hoka Carbon X2s because they were a great shoe, but I think these are just slightly better. They come in at £250. If you sign up on the website for the first time, you get 10% off. Or I think they do student discount as well of 10%. So still a hefty £225. Hook, I do claim on the website though that you can trial up to four pairs per year for 30 days and get a free refund. So if you do want to try them out, you can maybe take advantage of that. Maybe try out the X2s as well, see how we get on with them. And maybe pick your favourite. This is just a short video on these shoes. I can't wait to use them more often and get some good long sessions in and hopefully some races. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.